All right, so going to a tournament, and it's 36 degrees. Not something I thought I would be seeing in Texas, but I've got a couple ideas to keep me warm. Stick around, I'm gonna show you what that is. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, if this is your first time, welcome to the channel. But uh, we're talking today about staying warm while you're golfing. Right now it's 37, it's a slight mist, and uh, I'm about to tee off here in an hour. Uh, it's supposed to stay 37 the whole time, so I've documented in very, very many of my videos how much I hate the cold, which is why I live in Texas but it's February, so can I complain that it's 37 and I'm golfing? Well, yes, yes I can, um, but I still do it. So some of the things that uh, that I'm using, I've talked about the heated vest uh, link. I'm not gonna give the link below because you can't buy it anymore, which is totally disappointing. Um, but one of the things that this is a second time me using is this Zippo hand warmer. Um, made by the same people that do the Zippo lighter and it looks a lot a lot, lot the same so it actually has um, this top to it which has kind of a felt looking material um, and to use it you actually take this off right this felt piece off and there's some more felt I, and, and I'm saying felt I don't know what it is I'm sure it's not felt because it would burn um, but you basically pour lighter fluid the, and I use the Zippo lighter fluid, which I'm sure it's recommended, and I'll put a link for that below, but you basically filled in this hole. Funny story, I, you know, being a man, didn't read the directions, and so I just looked at the pictures real fast, and it looked like I was supposed to pour the lighter fluid directly on it, and I'm like, why is this taking so long? This is ridiculous. Um, finally, finally looked at them, learned that you could take that off, and lo and behold, you can pour it in that hole. So. Uh, let's actually jump into doing that and see how this works. Okay, so I've taken this apart. I'm gonna set that right here. And <clears throat> it comes with this neat little cup with a funnel on it. And it has a line up to the top for 12 hours. Now, there's no off switch. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go more than half because right now it's 1043. I'll probably finish the round maybe about five worst case scenario so jeff math that's over six hours um so we're gonna fill it up to be just a little more than half so it's just as simple as squeezing it in all right so we're about just over half worst case scenario all right, so we're done. All right, so now we have this guy. And all we're gonna do, we have the, the lid off. Remember, don't forget to do that. All I do is I'm just gonna pour it in here. Go, 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 go. All right. And it is in. Now we're gonna add a little bit to this felt part. And now we're going to put this back on. I'm gonna add just a little bit of fluid here. Okay, next. And that's it. So basically you just, um, you're, you're gonna have a flame and what the flame is doing is pulling that liquid up into the top of it. And I'm just gonna sit here and wait for this sucker to 
to burn out. Knowing of which, I have my um, my door ready to pop open because how safe is it to be burning this in my truck? Especially with the lighter fluid so close to my left hand. Uh, we're just gonna let it burn until it burns down. We're probably gonna speed ramp this sucker so you don't have to sit here and watch this burn down. Oh, maybe not. All right, and look at that. It's still hanging on to it on the on that left side, your right side. And I'm gonna wait for it to completely go out. I still see a slight flame there, but I can already feel the heat right here. And that's the best part because that means it's gonna be nice and toasty. flame is still going up. I would like that flame to stop. And we're going to put the top on this. And that's it. You then take this thing. Oh my gosh, that feels so good. That's nice and warm. You put it in this little pouch and you basically just tighten her down and she is ready to go. I'll skip filling the other one up for you, but the other fun thing that I got is <clears throat> this little beanie. How about that? It, uh, it has a battery in the back here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> has this nice little battery, right? Uh, and it has an external charger. So you just charge this sucker up and it slides back into this pouch you can see here. And then that fits in the back. Now, <clears throat> in the review, and I, the link is below, I saw that someone thought that, that it was uncomfortable in the, in the back of it, but it is not. So the, f I'm sure I'm gonna catch a lot of heck from my, my buddies, but you literally just click on that button, you see how it's red? Yes, I'm gonna become at, known as Rudolph, um, on the golf course and that's okay, but you, it has three different temperatures. You see the red changes to white for the medium and blue for the cooler side. Um, when I was testing this out uh, prior, uh, the red is almost too hot. Um, so the blue I think is supposed to last uh, somewhere in the six to seven hour range, I think, um, but what it what it's doing is you can feel the coils around your ears and um i don't know how low i'm gonna have to wear this but um i'm gonna also put on a rainproof um hat while it's actually raining because i don't don't want to uh, jeopardize it by getting it wet without me knowing for sure that it's waterproof but that's that's my tips for playing when it's warm i got my heated vest in the back i've got um warm golf gloves. Uh, I don't like them as much because they're thick. Uh, so that's why the hand warmers really come in handy. So I can have my golf glove on. My other hand will not be covered in anything and I can just slide them in my front pockets with those Zippo lighters. That's how I stay warm when it's 30s. So as always guys, click this like button, the subscribe button, bell notification, Thanks for joining the channel, and there's a lot more cool content coming. We'll talk to you guys later. Don't forget, just keep it findable. Ha! You thought it was over, but it's not. I just wanted to add that my round's over. It was probably maintained about 38 degrees with the hat, the vest, and the warmers in my pockets. I never got unbearably cold. Um, it was cool. It was raining, and for the most part, I mean, try this stuff out. It's super inexpensive stuff, um, and if you're golfing in this weather, it makes the weather totally bearable. So leave in the comments what you do for warm weather, or to stay warm when it's cold. I'd be interested to see what else, uh, what else everybody is using. So anyway, 
As always, and I said it a second ago, keep it findable. Share, like, subscribe, all that funny stuff. Anyway, we'll see you guys later.